Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 19th of 2025 is titled Comet Shuryumov Gerasimenko Creates Its Tails. So, what do we see here? Well, here we see the comet known as 67P Shuryumov Gerasimenko. And this is the comet that was explored between 2014 and 2016 by the Rosetta spacecraft. So the image here, taken in 2015, actually shows some of the jets of material coming off the comet. Now what we find, and what Rosetta was able to tell us, was that as a comet comes in close to the sun, and here we're looking at just the nucleus of the comet, just that central area, the solid piece of the comet itself, when that comes into the sun, it gets heated up. There's a lot of icy material there, and pockets of it can be vaporized, and that can expel material out in jets that then spread out. And that can help form what is called a coma around the comet. So in this case, Rosetta was inside the coma, so we don't see it, but that's what we'd see from Earth. We'd see that coma, and then we'd see tails stretching back. So here is some of that material being expelled off the surface of the comet, which will then be pushed back by the solar wind, creating the comet tail. Now, Rosetta did spend about two years exploring the comet, and was able to better help our understanding of how comets work. In fact, we found that the material that is being vaporized had to be well inside or beneath the comet's surface, and that would account for the jets. If it was just on the surface, it would just be more easily vaporized. You would not actually get jets of material streaming out the way we're seeing them. So that was one of the things that we learned about the comet. And the main mission of Rosetta was to orbit the comet for a couple years and to tell us about this. And it did that. This has a six and a half year orbit for the comet. So we were able to watch it over a good point as it came in closer to the sun, where it was at its most active and able to study the processes that were going on there. There was a second part of the spacecraft, which was a lander to land on the surface of the comet to study it up close. But because of an equipment failure, it was unable to anchor itself to the surface and bounced into shadow and was unable to recharge its batteries. And unfortunately, it was not able to get as much information as had been hoped. But Rosetta itself still gave two years worth of information about a comet, something we had never studied before. We've looked at comets, we've known of comets since ancient times, but we could never see the nuclei. A couple of times we flew by and visited a comet, but just saw it in passing. This was the only time we've ever orbited a comet and studied one comet in detail as it came in close to the sun to really try to better understand the process that is going on within these objects. So that was our picture of the day for October 19th of 2025. It was titled Comet Shiryumov Gerasimenko Creates Its Tails. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Big Heart. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.